you know, uh, the way the game is set up, they want you to um, put uh, fertilizer or poop into your soil. But I want to show you this is really doesn't matter. You don't need it. So I'm inspecting this. The lag is still unplayable. There's 80 quality soil here, right? And this soil here, which has been sold. Let me inspect this one here. It's 94. All right, so it's still it's higher quality, but doesn't really matter. You can sow into this soil that hasn't been, and you're still going to get good quality. Really want wheat for animals, so the quality of the soil really doesn't matter that much. So taking the time to plow it, replow it is, in my opinion, a waste of time. But I'm going to plant this side by side to show you that really doesn't matter. How do we get to 80 quality soil? Well, it was, nine, I think, 90. So if you don't, if you, um, that's been plowed. Um, every time you plow it, it goes up in quality, especially with the quality of the, um, the dung that you're using. So we're doing this side, one side is going to be with plowed and the other, and it doesn't, both of them are going to harvest at the same time. One's going to be slightly higher quality. That's all 80 and 94. And really my farming is only a 60 something. So, cause I'm really a forester. The person harvesting needs to be the high farming, but really what I've discovered is that, um, the quality of your what you get out of it is based on the quality of the soil. As you can see here, look, 85. Right here I got 89, right? And my farming is only a 60 if you look at my farming. So look at my farming here. See, my farming is only a 62, right? 66 with my stats. So even though my farming is only 62, I'm harvesting um, high quality seeds and what I should do is actually get rid of these here you should and that's why we have these barrels here and I'm actually going to put another barrel here create furniture barrel uh, I gotta equip Got two axes. Let's put the saw up there. And build. Build. It's good to have barrels in your in your field to put seeds in them. So if I look here, inventory here. I have actually put some crops in here. It's actually pretty much full. Oh, this is sleepers hammers wheat so I definitely need to pull that over there more sleepers hammers wheat probably more well, this isn't sleepers hammers wheat all right so oh 88 so, it's full. Eighty-eight. So what I'm doing is just putting the lower quality seeds. That's fifty-nine. 68 83 is fine right so put the lower quality there and then plant all of this here it's so funny that after the winter time this stuff grows so quick it's not funny Everything in this game could be sped up. I mean, it's just, it, it'd be nicer if everything was fast, fast, fast. I mean, 
that we're not grinding so much planning. It'd be nice like click and it's done. Click and it's done. Click and it's done. Click and it's done. It's so ridiculous. This shit takes so quick. It should, everything should be the speed of collecting water. Like, boom. Because if you watch anyone who actually plants, you know, they can plant much quicker than this. Once you have it plowed, it's basically walking and dropping seeds and kicking the soil over it. You don't have to sit here individually, put them in the ground. It's ridiculous. Some of the things I don't like about this game is just how much a grind and how slow it is to do mundane thing. Like I'm wasting my time sitting here doing this silly action. Um, it'd be nice if, for example, you could just um, highlight the area that you want to plant and then your character just does it. You know, like um, kind of like when you drop a building, you select the area, right? Um, and then it, he just you watch him just go there and plan it. You can leave the computer or whatever and he's gonna Or she is going to plant instead of you going every square click 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 like this. It's just ridiculous Yeah, I've stopped playing this game <laughs> But I figure I might as well fill up everything since uh, a lot of this also is comparing, compare and contrast. See, this is all. I think this was 90 quality. How much did it go down from one harvest? I can't remember. I'm sure this was like 94 quality soil, if I remember correctly. So look at this, waiting, waiting. Oh, finally, there it is. 83. So remember, 83. Ah. <sighs>
Yeah, if you uh, decide to play Life is Feudal, this is what you're going to enjoy doing. Mundane, 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 stuff like this here. If you're interested in buying Freeport, you can um, send me an email with your offer. So I'm not, you know, I'm entertaining offers, willing to sell Freeport. Um, I think um, each wall is consider the three months it took to terraform the island getting up all the walls, planting all the trees, harvesting everything, getting up the buildings, all of that stuff. So um, if you have any ideas, how would you price Freeport? Let me know. Freeport is probably one of the nicest bases on the on the map. It's an island, not many island bases. Um, it's got a trading post. It's got lots of storage, which, by the way, I got to make. That's actually why I want Horizon on. Is I have to make window units and doors. Okay, these are all done. All this is going to be going down. Let me, all this is going down. This whole area here. It's all going to go down to zero, zero. And these are already to be harvested. I just friggin' planted all this. This is just so fast. It's ridiculous how fast this stuff is growing now in the springtime. You're getting, let's see, four units, 89, 81, 88, 66. And that's why I have these archery targets here. So the archery targets right there fill up with They're not actually tombstones. <laughs> I don't know how many people actually thought they were tombstones. They're to store wheat. That's pretty much why I'm only growing wheat, because I can store it in the archery targets. That's all full. Eight to one.
<sighs> boring, boring, boring.
Are you getting up?
You're going to the toilet again? <laughs>